Okay, do a little video to show some of the accessories we've fitted to this Land Rover Discovery 3 over the last couple of weeks. Um, on YouTube you'll see the previous videos where we fitted the bits. So this is more of a sort of showcase now. We've pretty much done most of the stuff to this car. So what I'll do is I'll just walk around the car and um, let me start at the front and show you some of the products that we've, we do and have fitted and talk you through that. So this is the Discovery 3 base model. Um, some of the accessories, this is a grill, this is a conversion grill. We do a couple of grills for this. Um, this is one of the latest ones that we've just got coming in. Um, look on our website for those. We do those in chrome and black and chrome. We've also got a Discovery 4 replica grill that'll make the front look like a Discovery 4 coming in soon. If you look at the bonnet lettering, this has got standard lettering, but we do this same lettering in chrome and black. Now this vehicle isn't fitted with fog lights, but we do the fog light bezels in chrome. Um, we do a front number plate surround, again that's not fitted to this car. Okay, this car we fitted the 2010 Range Rover 20 inch alloy wheels to it. We fitted the colour coded wheel arches. Now these were standard fitment on the Discovery 4, but on the Discovery 3 they just had the same textured plastic as you can see on the bumper there adjacent to it. So we've done the video of how to fit those wheel arches. This side vent here is a Discovery 4 replica side vent um, for the Discovery 3, so it makes it look like the Discovery 4. If we move on to the side repeaters here, normally they were orange, and this is our clear version with the chrome background. Okay, just above here we've got the mirror covers. So we fitted color-coded, so they're Stornoway grey mirror covers we've got there. Um, we also do those in chrome, black and other body colours. Okay, just below that you'll notice this chrome trim here on the window rubber. So this goes all the way along. Okay. And we do that. We do the kit for that. That's a nice touch. Um, door handle covers, we do those body colour. We fitted a set of the chrome covers there onto this car. This has got the one piece handles with the smaller distance here but we do those for both types of handles. Okay if we look down at the bottom you see the silver strip here. This is the bright finished strip that was on the HSE Luxury Discovery 4 version. So we've done the video of how to fit those. Okay um, if we move now around to the rear, so we've converted the rear and we've, told, we've put the video online of how to do that. So this is the Discovery 4 rear lights fitted onto the Discovery 3. That's quite an easy conversion. If you look at the rear bumper here, we, this is the stainless rear bumper tread plate. Again, we've got that for sale. We've got a video of how to fit that on your vehicle. Okay, the lettering, we've got the lettering on the website, all of the lettering available in black and chrome and silver. Okay, if you look there, we've got the rear ladder. Okay, so this is our bolt-on, no-drill rear ladder that we've got on the website. Okay, we've done the video of how to fit that in the last couple of weeks. Um, this is the tailgate light housing. We do a cover for this and we do the replacement ones. We fitted the chrome one on here. I'll just zoom back a bit so you can see that. Okay, we've got those again on the website in different colours and uh, chrome. Right, the only other thing we've got, I think, I think I've covered most parts, is the roof rails. So if you look up here on the roof rails, these are the extended roof rails. So we've done the video of how to fit those and put those on the website. So, uh, on the interior, we do do some parts for the interior. We've done the video for the uh, these sill step covers here. We also do the alloy pedal covers. Um, it's a three-piece kit. We've got those available on the website. We've got upgraded steering wheels and the videos of how to change the steering wheels. We do the dash ends in different colors, walnut and black gloss. And again, we've done how to remove this central H section. You can look on our and the gear knob we do a, a gloss black gear knob and a video of how to change the gear knob so hopefully that gives you some inspiration obviously not all the parts are to everyone's taste but by hopefully putting a combination of parts together on this car which which is a base model early car um, hopefully we've inspired you to 
have a go at fitting some of the parts and, and having a go at making your discovery more individual.